Hi everybody, Steve Griffiths here, developer of the MT Predictor software program. Today I'd like to look at a great example of a holy grail trade um, using MT Predictor 6.5. This follows on beautifully from the comments uh, I made in yesterday's uh, customer only training webinar where I set this up for customers in advance. Just want to show you what I uh, explained to uh, the customers um, before the market actually unfolded and you'll see how this fits in beautifully with uh, the Holy Grail trade setup. First I looked at, if we look at the YM, this probably gives a clearer example. Um, this is a 15 minute chart of the day session only and what we had is if I put the DP on the prior pivot here you can see that as of, uh, this is, if I go back to here, this is early on uh, early in the day yesterday which was March the 28th that's Monday March the 28th you can see that on the 15 minute chart we had the market going up onto uh, DP resistance so what I was suggesting is that ideally the market should go to the opposing DP so let's put that on so I'll click on choose swing high or low click on the lower pivot here <clears throat> and as you can see we have a level around the 12135 area on the chart in advance and this is the whole import or this is the important part about the whole of this analysis is that it was all done in advance so you were prepared in advance before the market was due to unfold so what i said is ideally the market should come down and we were looking at a, a setup on the nq but after after that unfolded i said ideally what the market should do is come down then make a correction up which you can see is exactly what happened here and then I said ideally this correction up should unfold in an ABC <clears throat> and we'll have a look at the shorter term five minute chart in a minute for that but then the most important part is because the main trend was down into this decision point after a corrective high you should then be looking for a short trade down into <clears throat> this decision point area down here and as you can see, as of the end of the day, that's exactly what the YM did. So the point is, we set our roadmap in advance, before the market even got there. I was talking um, in the webinar about here. This is where, so right back here somewhere, is where I was talking to customers, excuse me, and setting this up for them, and actually showing you how the tools in MT Predictor allowed you to work in advance of the market, in other words, leading indicators. So bear with that in mind, <clears throat> let's now have a look at the um, five minute chart. So remember we were looking for an initial decline, then a correction up that should unfold as an ABC, then for the decline to carry on down. <clears throat> so if we go to a five minute chart, um, if I zoom out a bit, uh, let's put the DP on this was the same 15 minute high so do you remember we had a high up here and as you can see this decision point nailed the high of the day for us a very nice situation to be in and do you remember that then I said we were expecting a rally, sorry a decline into the DP off this low so I'll put that on and as you can see towards the end of the day this is exactly what happened but the most important thing <coughs> is if I go back to around about here which is when I was talking remember I said that what I was outlining uh, to unfold for an ideal setup was an initial decline which is exactly what we got this actually unfolds as a TS1 buy setup but remember we are looking for a decline so therefore you shouldn't really be looking for this ideally what we're looking for is to have a rally but this rally unfold as a corrective ABC and here we have as of just after one o'clock uh, New York time exactly what uh, exactly what happened we initially had a setup here and this setup was actually stopped out for a minus one hour loss so I'll just notice that note that down so we do actually make losses uh, when trading every professional trader knows and understands that but the loss was kept small and under control but we had a second bite at the, the trade setup which is on this bar here so let's put the analysis on <clears throat> now here standard trade uh, setup 
even though it's against the blue STF, because you remember we've set the 15 minute trend to be down, so therefore we're looking, this is why we're looking for a short trade here. Now, the point I want to stress here is if I scroll this out a bit, do we want to be looking for the first target, which is way up here, or because we are aiming down here for our 15 minute DP support, can you see how this is where the typical wave 3 WPT lies so ideally we shouldn't be aiming for the first target we should actually be aiming for our lower target which is a typical way 3 WPT in other words we're looking for a strong way 3 type decline and you see how this was all set up in advance in other words when the I was talking which was <clears throat> uh, 10.30 to 11.30 which was around about here this was actually two hours in advance of this setup arriving so you're preparing for this two hours in advance. Now that's what I call good, uh, a good preparation. As we can see, the market did indeed take us into a setup, then indeed decline down into this target. Um, we then look for the STF. The STF is strong, so we look to trail the trade, and it actually went through to the end of the day. So if we put the risk reward on, this trade would then have been stopped out at the end of the day for an absolutely massive 9R profit. Yes, this trade would have made nine times the initial risk. So can you see how even after a small minus 1R to start with, to then bank minus 9R means you are well up overall. And this is the key to successful trading. But the whole point of this video is how we set this trade up well in advance in how we use the 15 minute chart to get our DP resistance up here we then projected in advance our 15 minute DP support and because of that we said that the trend was then going to be down into that we then moved down a time frame onto our shorter term 5 minute charts and then looked to see where we'd get an initial decline and then an initial correction but more importantly if I zoom in a bit that initial correction should unfold as an ABC which is our automatic TS3 setup then because our target was the lower DP here we then were aiming for the typical way 3 WPT which is this target down here not the first targets that's why we were waiting for a larger decline which is exactly what unfolded and as you can see the result a, an absolutely massive plus 9R trade and as such this is an absolutely brilliant example of my holy grail setup because here we have an important high here we have the initial decline off that important high in Elliott wave terms a wave 1 we then have the initial correction in Elliott wave terms a wave 2 we then have a strong wave 3 type decline to unfold in fact actually let's see whether the Elliott wave uh, on major actually picks that up um, and there it does actually what I'll do is if I just make this a little bit clearer so I'll just have a slightly larger font on this and if I just turn this color uh, to something like green and I just take that off let's put that on again so on the major setups if I come down to the end of the day here can you see how this initial decline was a wave one the initial uh, rally which we had here unfolded as an ABC into a wave 2 we then had a strong wave 3 decline into at least the typical wave 3 WPT that's the holy grail setup that is why when we come to the automatic setups we don't gun for the first target we go for the lower at least the lower typical wave 3 or further out typical wave 3 WPT because that fits in with our large degree picture and as we can see, running it into the end of the day here, produce a lovely 9R profit. So a great example of my Holy Grail setup and a great example of a brilliant trade uh, of plus 9R. But the most important point is this whole trade was set up and prepared for literally two hours in advance, even before it started to unfold. And that is the key to successful trading being prepared in advance and allowing and having tools that work in advance of the market in other words leading indicators so great example using the MT predictor software program that as you can see produced an absolutely fantastic massive 9R profit on the 5 minute YM yesterday